minus 25 seconds. Flight lock in. T minus 15, 14, 13, ignition. 12, 11, T minus 10, 10 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3. We have ignition of the RS-68 engines. 2, 1, 0. We have liftoff of the United Launch Alliance Delta IV heavy rocket carrying the NRO L-65 mission to the National Reconnaissance Office. You are hearing the voice of Steve Agate providing launch vehicle ascent data. Under 28 feet per second, downrange distance about one tenth of a nautical mile. MEQ, perform post adoption. command to go to the partial thrust mode. Roger. Passing one minute. Chamber pressure is uh, holding, as we expect. One minute, 15 seconds into the flight. Passing one minute, 20 seconds. Max Q, maximum dynamic pressure in the vehicle. Now one minute, 25 seconds. Mach 1, vehicle now going transonic. Passing the one minute, 30 second mark. Altitude now passing seven nautical miles. with off to the... 1,645 feet per second, downrange LC, distance, this is RC on one. Six nautical miles. Go RC. Roger, I have first motion time. Roger? Roger, we have first motion time of 18 colon 03 colon 00 decimal 224. Timber pressure holding nicely in all decimal three boosters. Decimal 224, copy. Good Full go. thrust mode in the port and starboard booster, partial thrust mode in the core. LC, MEQ. Go MEQ. Post lift up, securing complete. Roger. Coming up on two minutes. Mark, two minutes into the flight altitude now, passing 13.5 nautical miles. Velocity 2,224 feet per second. Downrange distance 5.9 nautical miles. Two minutes, 15 seconds in. This is the MD on countdown that one. Good. Today's launch is dedicated to the brave men and women who serve for our nation's freedom. MD out. Two minutes, 30 seconds. Chamber pressure holding very well in all three boosters. Full thrust in the port and starboard, partial thrust in the core. Two minutes, 43 seconds in. The Delta vehicle now only weighs one half of what it did at launch some two minutes, 48 seconds ago. We're expelling propellant at the rate of 4,745 pounds per second. Coming up on two minutes, 55 seconds. Altitude now passing 28.1 nautical miles, velocity 5,041 feet per second, downrange distance 34 nautical miles. About 45 seconds remain in three booster flight, passing 3 minutes 15 seconds. Coming up on three minutes, 30 seconds in, still looking good. Chamber pressure holding in all three boosters. Port and starboard boosters continue in the full thrust mode and core booster in partial thrust. Three minutes, 40 seconds in. About 15 seconds uh, remain until we go to the partial thrust mode. Standing by. And we're going to the partial thrust mode in all three boosters now. Standing by for Miko, the main engine cutoff on the port and starboard, and for separation. We've had separation of the port and starboard boosters from the core. FISBO, LC. Core booster has ramped up to full uh, thrust net mode. One. FISBO on one. 
Operation 70, Step 70, for more in the OSM uh, Ghost mode. Established in squad booster disabled. until shortly before main engine cutoff, about one minute from now. I'm sorry, that uh, that is not on my console. Copy. And USO, establish solid motor SNA arm permission minute, safe. 50 seconds in. Safe. Still looking good. Coming up on the five minute mark. Five minutes into the flight. About 20 seconds now remain until we get the command to go to the partial thrust mode in the core booster. ALC, perform console securing. Alpha 3 Charlie. Pie. Roger and work. Launch enabled, disabled. Okay, we've got the partial thrust command. Warrants enabled, disabled. Standing by from Miko. And we've had Miko. NAOC reports complete. Roger. TC order enable coming off. Off. Standing by for one, two, set. Order enable red tag is on. And we've had one, two, set. That deploy is in work. LC, net one. Semi-Q on one. Igniter Spark. HGM standing by for ignition, and we have ignition. Ignition on the second Roger. stage. Second stage chamber pressure is beginning to rise. Good chamber pressure on the second stage. Six minutes, three seconds into the flight. Standing by for a payload fairing separation. <laughs> 